they just back everything up when they left the island? <sighs> it's really dusty. You can't even see the cute flower design. Aww. So now we know that uh, Henry didn't stay in this room and he kind of became an alcoholic. I guess trauma from the war will do that mm -hmm. to you. They all look so complicated and boring. <laughs> oh, that's funny. <laughs> I mean, clearly, uh, Franny's mom wasn't opposed to having a drink herself, but I imagine it wasn't nearly to the degree that uh, Henry did. That say? But the old poker. Okay. Do we know that he stayed in the silver bird room the entire time? I guess that would make the gold bird room, uh, fucking what's his name? Charlie? Was that his name? Oh, Dee's father's room. Alright, let's see what these dolls do for us. If I had to guess, I would say maybe Franny's doll has to be moved to the middle so she can hold both of their hands. And then I would guess that her papa's doll has to go here. Um. And then her mom doll will go here. Um. Yeah, okay. <gasps> yeah. Why the doll's getting along? I wonder what's in there. Alright, let's take a and look. And in here... A key. And a ribbon. Got the sprout I wonder key. which room this key's for. What's this? It's a ribbon Franny loved. Well, I can't take it and put it on, on the bear? It doesn't look very faded to me. Oh well. So now we got another key. And I don't think there's anything left in this room to look at. Yes! Sick. Let's go in. Looks like some kind of office or study. Oh. Not here either. Where could you be, Jessica? Alright, let's get a look at these. They're so full of books, I wonder how long it would take to read them all. <laughs> Probably an entire lifetime, if I had to guess. Uh, let's see. Alright, let's start with one end of the room and work our way around. Uh, let's... what's this? <gasps> Nice table and it's not broken or anything, even after all this time. Someone left a book open here. Why are they were they looking something up? Hmm. hmm. Wonder what color it was originally. <gasps> oh. Oh neat, a quill pen. I always wanted to try one. No good, it's all dried out and hardened. Can't write a thing. <laughs> Alright, so there's nothing on the desk. Uh, let's see, what about the table? Huh. This marble table looks expensive. It looks kind of cold when you touch it. No, I wanted to look at the newspaper. I guess it's not relevant. It's big and comfy. Hmm. But it's probably not great for watching TV from here. Oh, yeah, that's a tiny TV. Alright, uh, we're gonna try to keep to one side of the room and keep working our way around. So next would be the TV. Hmm? Power button, is there a remote for this thing? No, this thing's very old school. This looks more in line with the TV I had, except the TV I had was a lot bigger. And it wasn't really my TV, it was in the living room of the, the house I lived in, but still. Okay, It's a hummingbird. hummingbird. It's crooked. This bothers me to no end. 
Can I not fix that? Oh. Sheet music. This is sheet music, isn't it? Yep. For the piano. Why was it hidden behind a painting? Hmm. The painting is of this bird. Ah! Uh, yes, my guy? <laughs> Franny? Did you know there's a puzzle hidden in this sheet music? If you solve the puzzle and play the music, you'll get to see the piano's secret. I just remembered something. All right, my guy. Spill the beans. This is the sheet music Franny played on the piano. Oh, really? I wonder if I'd be able to play it. You can play? Yeah, I practice on a school piano once in a while. Will you try playing this song? I'll give it a shot. Maybe it'll help jog some more memories. Franny told me there's a puzzle hidden in this sheet music. Hmm, I wonder what it could be. Is there perhaps another hummingbird facing the other way that has more music? Oh, this is the golden bird room. Oh, let's see what else there is. Ready? <gasps> oh! This... is this painting of Franny? It looks like the sketch in the art studio. Where do you think that Dee was friends with her all those years ago? Okay. Hmm? Picture is filthy, guess it's gathering dust a long time. Closet? Mm. Closet's been cleared out. Okay. Tableware huh. shelf. There's a bunch of different kinds of alcohol from all over the world. Hmm? By the bed is what they used for light. I'd be too scared to have flames right next to my bed. That's a good point, yeah. But back in the day, that's all they had. Oh, there's a thing there. Uh huh. Hummingbirds. Okay. From the door knockers to tableware to paintings to sculptures in the fountain, a hummingbird motif permeates every corner of this mansion. The fact that there are so many hummingbird decorations indicates that Lawrence had a strong fixation on them. Hummingbirds can be a symbol of healing and love, and are apparently a popular motif in Native American cultures as well. I believe it's possible, possible Lawrence included hummingbirds all throughout the mansion as an attempt to alleviate his loneliness. It reminds me of something Sayoko once told me. In Japan, <clears throat> the crane has long been associated with good fortune. Designs featuring this particular bird are very popular. Origami cranes are the most popular as a means of making a wish. As such, those who wish for peace or a speedy recovery from illness will often make them in droves. So perhaps Lawrence's hummingbird decorations were made with were made with a with a wish for peace in his own life. Some typo there. Sayoko taught me how to make origami cranes a long time ago. Maybe I should make a few and leave them around the mansion with a wish that the departed may rest in peace. So I'm guessing that uh, in Marie's goodbye letter, she meant to say golden bird room as opposed to silver bird, because it makes sense that this one would be for Henry, given how he has a picture of Franny and a bunch of alcohol in here. I guess now that we have this, we can go out to the piano. Sheet music can't be used here. What the fuck? Um, I do have the sheet music. What are you talking about? Oh, I get it. What's this? So I gotta like take a picture of that, I think? So my problem now is that I, I have all the puzzle pieces I need to do this, I just don't know how to trigger the thing that I need to happen. Do I have to use it? No, I can't even use items here. Um... Yeah, I have. Oh, do I have to? Oh, well, I'm an idiot. There we go. And then music staff without mm. any notes. All right, maybe now play. You can do it. Do your best. You'll be fine. Here goes nothing. So, oh no, I don't. Oh no, uh, X, B, A, X, Y, A, X, 
be. Hmm. Well, your plate sounded kind of lovely compared to when Franny played it. Oh, lonely. Maybe it's missing a component. I have what I need. I just don't know how to get them to mesh. Can I layer one photo on top of the other? Okay, how does how the hell do I do this? Uh, oh, overlay. Duh. Okay. Uh, and then you just do it like... Yeah. And I just need to transcribe it. God, that was obtuse. Okay. Yeah. Alright, let's play it. Here we go. Okay, that part was just frustratingly obtuse. But I got it. <sighs> Piano music. Ashley, did you hear that? Sounds like it triggered something. Let's look around. A box fell out of the piano. I wonder what it is. Oh, hello. This is... Oh no, is that... Okay, it's clearly a box of rocks and shells. Is that a condom? Granny found these on the beach. Is one of them a condom? It's shells. They're kind of pretty. Oh, right. I remember these. Franny found them. These are our treasure. She hid them here. Hmm? What's this card? It looks like a game cartridge. Is this Franny's too? No. I've never seen that. Oh, maybe it's our papa's. Oh, it's not a condom, thank god. <laughs> that looks suspiciously like a condom from afar. What's that noise? It's the das. What's it doing? Did it read the card? Recognize the another key, okay. Oh, there's three of them. Okay. And it looks like a brain. Clever. Another key feature. Okay. Uh, another keys. I've never seen this screen. Is this a map of the mansion? One of the rooms is glowing. What's this another key? I have no idea. Another key. Huh. Well, it's obviously something our papa... Oh, fuck. Somebody's what here. The... Somebody's here! Who are you? Uh... I've Who... been waiting for you. Who the fuck? I don't recognize this guy. That's not Richard, is it? If so, they heavily redesigned him. And we didn't see Richard for a while in the uh, original game. Like, not until maybe the fourth or fifth chapter. What, really? Already? Okay. Ashley. <gasps> I'm your father. Are you sure? What? You look nothing like the original design. What do I do? That's... 
He's my dad? Oh, maybe it is Richard. He does have kind of the same look to the face. Ashley? It, yeah? But like I said, they really changed up his design. Look at you, all grown up. I... I've been waiting for you to arrive. I don't know what to say. In the original game, he hugged his daughter when they reunited. There's so much I've always wished I could tell him. I can't even think straight. My heart feels like it's going to pound out of my chest. I've got a lump in my throat. I, I can't talk. I don't know what to say. Just seeing you in front of me, it's... It's a little overwhelming. Dad. Ashley. Oh, there we go. That's the hug I recognize. Say you have your mother's eyes. This is so weird. When he hugs me, I smell cigarettes. This man, he's my dad. I finally met my dad. Yeah, her father's Dad? kind of a bad person. Where's Jessica? Hmm. Well, I haven't seen her. How is that possible? Did Jessica let you wander off? N no, she told me to stay put. I was being a brat, so she probably wanted to get away from me. I tried to catch up to her, but I couldn't. Then when I got near the mansion, I heard her scream. I found her glasses on the ground by the gate. What? I didn't hear anything. Why didn't you come to the dock to meet us? Well, I was... I... I was conducting an experiment that took longer than I expected. I'm sorry, Ashley. <sighs> okay. I guess it was too important to walk away from, huh? I'm really worried about Jessica. If you haven't seen her either, we have to look for her. Of course I'll help look for Jessica. By the way, did you bring the DAS? Yeah, I have it right here. Good, I'm glad you got it, Ashley. Why did you send it to me? There'll be time to explain it all later. Just hold on to it for now. Okay. Oh, yeah. The DAS made a weird noise earlier. What? Sorry, I'm not saying much. Plot heavy. The screen is... The system's online. Okay. Two in the west wing and one in the east. We have to get those chips before he does. Look at that face. I don't trust that face. Well, that's odd. One has already been unlocked. Unlocked? Are you talking about this? Oh, Ashley. Well done. Thank you for bringing this to me. Where did you find it? It was in the piano. In the piano? Really? What is this? Why was it in the piano? Hmm... It's a key that starts a very important device called the Another. But Bill stole it. Bill? Let's start with Bill, since he is the other person on this island we have to account for. Who's Bill? A scholar who helped me with my research. He was my assistant and is absolutely brilliant. But he betrayed me. He tried to steal the research we did on this island. Ashley, your mother and I dedicated our lives to our research on another. But Bill wanted to claim it for himself. That's horrible! I managed to stop him, but he had already hidden the keys from me. The Another needs keys? That's right. There are three keys total. The remaining two should still be somewhere in this mansion. I see. I think, if I recall correctly, he, Richard, stole the work from Bill. Which is why he looks fucking evil. 
What is the another? Why are you out here all alone on this island? And you told Jessica to tell me you were dead? Why? Tell me everything. All of it. <sighs> another was my and your mother's research project. Once complete, it could heal a great many people. It can heal people? That was the hope, anyway. But we knew there were people who might try to steal it from us. That's why I continued my work here, where no one could find me. I thought I could trust Bill, but it seems I was wrong. <sighs> and I think Bill may have taken Jessica. What? She's in danger. We need to find her right away. Then let's go find her, right now! It's not so simple. I need to get the another keys in order to protect it. Dad, we... What do we do? Let's split up. You look for Jessica, and I'll look for the another keys. I mean, I already found one, and clearly he doesn't know where the fuck to look. Ashley, I can't let you do that. You don't have a choice, my guy. It's literally just us two. And the boat comes back at nightfall. I'll be okay. I can find them using the DAS. I've already managed to solve all sorts of puzzles around here. Finding a few more keys will be no sweat, even if Bill's hidden them. Okay. If you're sure, I'll leave the keys to you. Just hurry and find Jessica. Don't worry. I'll find her. Hey, Dad? Yes? Once we have all the another keys, and you find Jessica, then we can all go home. Together. Right? Of course. So the sooner you find those keys, the better, right? Uh-huh. Well then, you should take this. The last key? Where should I start looking? The DAS shows something on the second floor of the West Wing. You should be able to get in with that key. Thank you, Dad. Now that place is dark, so be careful. I'm sure I'll find Jessica soon. Meet you in the foyer? Deal. Okay, I'm off. Good luck. Now, is he gonna hang around a bit? Because I do have some stuff I want to show to him. In the first game, you're able to show things to the people you are having a conversation with, and they would have special dialogue for it. What the hell happened? Why did he just grip his wrist? Ashley? Huh? What? I'm glad you finally got to meet your father. Yeah. You don't seem very happy. Is something wrong? No, I'm happy. But, I don't know. I've got this weird feeling. You probably just need a chance to take it all in. Yeah, maybe that's it. Dad couldn't see you. That's because he only believes what he can see, like every other adult. I'm used to not being seen. Oh, he sounds so sad. Even when you were alive, were you not seeing him? So, are you going to help your father? Of course. I want to help if I can. So, yeah. I'm gonna find the another keys for him. I see. Will you help me, Dee? I would be happy to. I think she knows that her father is actually um... the villain here. From the DAS, use the feature to find the remaining another keys. So is he still in there? No? God damn it. That was a thing in the uh, DS game. Before you actually had the big serious talk with the uh, with the uh, other person, you could show them things and they would have unique dialogue options. Like if I showed him the picture of, uh, of uh, Ashley's mom, he would have said something. If I showed him something that I didn't, he didn't have anything to say about, he would be like, Oh, sorry, I don't know anything about that. Oh, sorry, I don't know anything about that. Oh, sorry, I don't... And... Like, they would have special dialogue things. Ugh. All right.
Library B? It's pitch black in here. It smells kind of damp, too. It's been neglected all this time. Is there really in another key hidden in here? Let's double check on the DAS. It's showing me a room deeper in. Oh, like a hidden room. There may be something behind the bookshelf, but it's so dark. I can't just go fumbling around blind in there. I'll check out what's past here. D. This way, Ashley. What way? <laughs> Did I mention I'm sort of scared of the dark? I can't move. Oh no, this is a puzzle. Try looking around to find a way forward from Ashley's perspective. Uh... <gasps> oh! Oh, it's... Wait, is that a hole in the ground? Oh, no! <laughs> Can I fall in that? I'm too curious. I can't even get to it. God damn it. Hmm... I mean, that clearly. No, that's not a door handle. Never mind. Huh? Hmm. Do I have to take the candle from the old one? Okay, so I can't... Can I... I cannot fall in there. God damn it, it's just a maze. Maybe I have to use the lighter on the candle. Let's try it. There we are. Yeah. Um... Yeah, why wouldn't I? Uh, let's try putting it over here. <gasps> All right. The floor collapsed. Ugh, this mansion's a death trap. Dad's really been living here all along? Now, where did D go? You wanna jump for it? There's D. Oh. This is... I've enjoyed reading books here ever since I was young. I wanted to be a novelist. D, where are you? Hmm. So to get over the hole to the other side... Huh? The bookshelf is crooked. It's a little wobbly. It might go through the floor if you push it. Maybe I can knock this over. Ugh. Did it go through the floor? Okay. That was dangerous. <laughs> Ashley, are you okay? Uh, yeah. I'm fine. D sounds like he's farther in. I can use the bookshelf to get across now. Though it seems pretty unstable. This is so scary. Yeah, but you gotta. At least it didn't go through the floor. Like, that could have very easily broken the floorboards and gone through. I can't take the candle now, can I? Um... Yes. Take that shit. Is it just me or is it getting smaller? <laughs> 